Hello, I'm the Budget Modeler and welcome to another tutorial. This week, how to make foam sanders. You'll need a ruler, coffee stirrers, micro or mini saw, super glue, super glue accelerator, not essential, some low density foam, the sort used in cushions, and some medium density foam, the stuff used in packaging, a good pair of scissors, and of course, sanding paper. I'm using 12 mil low density foam that I've cut to approximately twice the width of the stirrers. Taking the super glue, we spread it down the length of the stirrer, as far down as our foam is going to go. Then, gently, and I mean gently, press the foam to the stick. The reason I say gently is the super glue will melt the foam to the stick in a solid clump if you press it too hard. Next, check around the stirrer and glue down any areas where the foam didn't stick. Now, we take our sandpaper. and mark around our stirrer with a pen or a pencil. Once we've marked around it, we can then cut it out. Get the super glue and apply it to the back of the sandpaper, trying to cover all the sandpaper up to the very edges. Take the foam covered stirrer in one hand and the sandpaper in the other and very gently attach the two together. Be patient with this part and try to be as precise as possible as most of the time you only get one shot at this. Finally, write the grit size on the back of the stirrer. This is so you know which one it is. This type of foam sander is great for rounded edges, like the leading edge of a wing, a fuselage seam. You can see here how it contours itself to this piece of sprue, so it won't give you any flat spots. The medium density foam sanders are made in exactly the same way, apart from using super glue, I've used a well-known heavy-duty glue, as the super glue doesn't work on this type of foam. It melts it rapidly. Well, if you like what you see, please subscribe to my channel to help it grow. Get the message out there to as many models as possible. Like the video and ring my bell. Remember, stay safe, keep on modelling. 